It's a great day for a drive, especially in a 2018 Jeep Grand Cherokee. Has this nice white exterior, black cloth interior, seating four five, and you have the four doors plus the lift gate. As well, it has a 3.6 liter V6 engine paired with an automatic transmission, and it's a four by four. It also has a train management, navigation, reverse camera, and many more features. If you'd like to take this vehicle out on a test drive, you can book it online at islandford.ca. Stay tuned, we're gonna have a look under the hood and inside and out. It's a 3.6 liter V6 engine paired with an automatic transmission, and it's a four by four. Let's have a look inside. the door as well as power locks windows and mirrors the driver's seat is powered with lumbar your passenger seat is manually adjusted all weather mats on the floor and you have your lighting controls as well as your gas cap release and then on the face of the steering wheel we have the badging of course for the jeep you've got your menu hands-free dialing and your cruise control and this is a push start so my foot's on the brake keys in the pocket we're gonna push the engine start stop button on the dash any important messages the odometer reading and you would be able to go into the menu and toggle through. We've got this nice big display screen here and we're showing the max AC and the AC and you have your front and rear defrost, dual climate control, heated seats, heated steering wheel. You've got your radio and media there and the navigation. So let's go in there and the reason I want to go into the navigation is because sometimes you have the button but you don't have the capability. It doesn't have the SD card or it doesn't have the the setup for it, it's just a blank. So you wanna go in there and see if you can actually choose a location so you can go and search and go on the map and so forth. So that tells you that it's working, especially if it's asking you where to. The other thing that you can do is put your vehicle in reverse. You're gonna see your backup camera view right off the bumper here. There's your center line and green, yellow, red is just telling you how close you are to other objects or vehicles. So let's put us back into park. So our volume and tuner down below, we have our hazard lights. You can turn the screen right off if you want. There's your dual climate control right there. There's your fan. AC, front and rear defrost, and then you have your parking sensors, auto stop start for less idle time, you've got your eco, sport on, and your traction control. And then we can just press buttons here. Down below, USB outlets, as well as a 12 volt and auxiliary line. You just close that up if you don't want it. And your automatic shifter, a couple of cup holders, and then you have your four wheel drive low, as well as your hill descent. And then you have your terrain management here. So you've got snow, sand, auto, and then there's mud and rock. So that gives you more or less control and traction as needed. This is a four by four. And when we open up the armrest, we can open up the bin. We've got a shallow one there, plus you got a 12 volt, lots of room to put stuff. Let's close it right up. And then off to the side is your glove compartment. And then you have the SOS there and the assist as well. You've got lighting controls up top, lift gate release, universal garage door opener, and you also have a power moonroof. Your screen is manually adjusted just by sliding it forwards and backwards, but this can open up and vent for you. And the reason I'm not opening it today is I got a little bit wet earlier, so we're leaving it closed, but you're all set to go. 20 inch wheel, body colored door handle with easy entry, that little black dot you're seeing on the handle. So in the fobs in close proximity, you can unlock the door and you have your driver's side fuel cap. A little bit of a spoiler and a windshield wiper. Below the Jeep badge is where your backup camera is located. Backup sensors on your bumper, four and seven pin connector, and a trailer hitch with a cover. And then when you're ready to open up that lift gate, all you have to do is double click your fob. It'll power it open for you. And you can hear it chiming so you know that it's open securely. Got a nice tonneau cover back here. This just can pull across, keep everything out of sight. You got hooks and tabs. You also have a cargo net. There's your release for your lift gate as well when you want to close it up. And you've got a 12 volt and then you've got this nice all weather mat. That's and then you just push this and your spare tire and your funnel is located there. And there's other clips and tabs located here. And then when you want to close it up, there's handles on the right and the left. I prefer the button. So I'm just going to push this and it chimes to let you know it's going down securely. And you can just lock it up and walk away or jump in and head out on your latest adventure. And on your vehicle, Bob, you have remote start. You can speaker in the door as well as power windows. You also have a grab handle on the body and seating for three with a 60-40 split. Simply pull the lever at the base of the seat and bring it right down. You now have access to the back cargo area. There's a nice tonneau cover as well. You've got an all-weather mat back there and anchors on the back of the seat to be able to tether baby seats. Then just give it a push back into the upright position and you flip up the headrest. In the center is an armrest with a couple of cup holders, all-weather mats on the floor and slim pockets on the back of the front seat. Your air vents are located there as well 
Bell's 115 volt and just little cubbies. Up top you have a moonroof and you also have lights and handles off to the side. Tow hitch in the rear with a cover. You have privacy glass in the back windows, roof rails. You also have a moonroof, adjustable side view mirrors, halogen headlights, fog lights, tow hooks, and so many more reasons to visit us. If you like this video and would like to see more, please subscribe. We have plenty to share with you and we love to hear your comments.